Hello, internet friends, and welcome back to Surviving the Aftermath. So, we just got our first car and sent it off on a little mission. And we are also waiting on 15 more hours and we can get wheat. Awesome. Oh, which reminds me, we can research stuff. So, let's research, uh, I guess, the fortress. Um, oh, actually, that would be kind of cool to do that. Oh, and we have a disaster forecaster. What does that require? Hmm. Let us see. What do we need? Oh, yeah. Okay. So, that's the gate, garage. So, radar. It's going to cost us 30 power. But it'll give us three days warning before something bad happens. So, that's actually really great. That's something that we really, really could use. Is a bit more warning before things uh, start going terrible. So, let's put one of those there. And we're going to need more power to uh, to go with that. So I guess let's just kind of keep going with the pattern that we're doing there. Um, you know what? Actually, I'm going to resume this and work this and actually demolish that. <clears throat> That's how we're going to do that. Oh, I guess I should probably uh, do a bit of that as well. Okay. So, I don't know if we have enough components to make all of this. We are uh, a bit low on the metals right now, it looks like. Um, yeah, we are very low on the metals. Um, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Low on the metals. So... We will eventually get all that built, and hopefully another disaster isn't going to happen before then. But, uh, I guess we'll see. So, okay, so we got these guys back. Okay, so you are taking a car back there. Awesome. Uh, I would really love for you to go pick up all that wood. And you guys are gonna, I guess... Yeah, see, I don't know how if I if I put you there, can I like take a person? Okay. Okay. So, can I Okay, so if I want to like move you there, can I take you? Why can I not go onto the research? Is it because I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna move you there, though. Oh! Yes? Wait, what are you doing? Why can I not? Please, I would like to... There we go. There we go. That's what I wanted. Okay. Thank you. And you should be able to get that, too. Okay, there we go. There's, there's all the action points spent. Okay, cool. Thank you. I'm glad that works like I wanted it to. Okay. So they're going to fill that up with some... Whoop, that's not what I wanted. They're going to fill that up with some gas. Uh, our guys are doing good. Uh, okay, so that's why they're not able to do more, is they need... Yeah, so we're running into this perpetual problem of not having enough firewood. Um, oh, the trade convoy arrived. Yay! Yay! So what this means is that we're actually able to build, or we're able to build, we're able to get wheat now. So that's actually really cool. I think I actually kind of want to demolish these and actually put a farm field. We'll do a field, a large field over here. And I think this is the... I think that's the one that it is. I can't tell. I think, yeah. I think it goes this way. Okay, so I want to put it there. Okay. That's going to be our wheat field. We're going to build that up, and that's going to be wheat field. Um, and hopefully then we can uh, do a bit more. So is there another colony that is willing this? Ooh. Flushton has firewood. How much do they want to trade us for firewood? Oh, this place, Rackham, what do they have? Uh, can we trade with them a fun box? And that's a sunflower seed. So 
Sunflower is not grown for food, but it is an energy potential. Harvested seeds are turned to oil to be processed in a refinery for fuel. I have not seen that come up. I have not seen that come up. Huh. That could potentially be good. And what is this? Is this a cabbage? Whoop, can't cancel that. Um, <clears throat> huh, that's not bad. Cabbage is easy to grow, resilient, and yields a good harvest. Cabbages are a fine choice for a post-apocalyptic farmer. Normal growth rate, medium yield, high resilience, and average nutrition. Oh, buffalo worms? That's, oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, I feel like cabbage would be a great thing to get. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, does this place have carrot seeds or is this just uh Oh, it is carrot seed. Ah, cancel. No, I just want to find out what carrot is. Fast growth rate, medium real medium yield, low resilience, average nutrition. Okay. Well, hmm. Maybe we don't need to trade anything right now. No, that's silly. We have stuff. We should definitely trade for it. Yeah, no, we should definitely trade for stuff. Oh, yeah, at the very least, we need firewood. So let's trade with these guys. Um, yeah, soybean seed. I know we looked at that before. Normal growth rate, high yield, poor nutrition. Yeah. Actually, honestly, soybean would probably be pretty great because of the high yield. But we're doing good on food. Well, yes. Hmm. Well, that's okay. Soybean would just go into... Hmm. I don't know. I feel like the... Well, can you use the soybean in to make the more nutritious mixed meal food along with the meat? Because if you can, then... Huh. I think we go with soybeans. I think we do. I think we go with firewood. I think we need that firewood. I really do. Ooh, that's a lot of money, though. If we trade them some medicines, they'll like us a lot better. Hmm. We have a ton of fiber. Can we just trade away a bunch of fiber? Like, 200 fiber? I don't think we need nearly as much fiber as we have. Yeah, let's just trade away a ton of fiber. Hunting rifles, junk, components, clothing. I don't really want to get rid of that stuff. Plastics, not bad. Concrete's not bad. I don't really want to... I really don't want to spare this stuff because medicine is... You can't get it anywhere else. Hunting rifles, I guess I could spare a few. Yeah, let's do that. That's actually going to get me back some. Um, can I... What can I get for 235? Oh, 235. Confirm. Okay. All right. So that's going to be good, I think. Okay. Let's confirm that. It's going to take two days. I think that's going to be worth it. All right. Let's do that. Let us do that. All right. Cool. I like it. So that's got a car in it. Not a great car. It can hold four people, though. Wow. Medium durability. Uh, close out of that. Let's go back to these people. Can you please get that? Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Pick up some of those components, please. Thank you. All right. And then I guess you guys just continue on doing what you're doing. Yes, you're picking up wood. Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, those weapons are not a bad thing either to get. Okay. Oops. Construction completed. Large field. I would like for you to grow wheat. I'd like for you to grow wheat. 
Um, we are doing great on this, honestly. I think, actually, we stuff that field. Stuff that field? I don't think that's the right... I think that's the right terminology for that, but... Yeah, they get rid of the field, and then... Yeah, we can do that. Hey, did I ever research the thing that gets me guard houses? Is that a thing that I did? No, because I didn't research guardians. I should do that, though. Um... Guardians and Weaponsmiths, I think, are two things that we need. And that will allow us to better defend ourselves when the bandits come. Okay. So you got that. Got some currency. I want you to go over here next, please. Get the rest of those guys. Now, I'm wondering if... Oh, well, no. It's just they have 0% chances to blow up because we're, like, still in the safe zone, kind of. Okay. So there's that. Cool. You can head back here. And this is about to, well, I guess, I don't know. Let's say it's about to head back into... All right, so where can we move this to? I was going to say, I guess we can go out there. Yeah. I guess we can kind of go out there. Yeah. We're still gathering up some wood. Yeah, so this is about to turn into a bigger fortress, I think. So let's see what happens when it finally does get there. When it, I don't know, it's bigger. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. I don't know. Let's see. Hey, look at that. We got two spotlights now. Look at that. Yeah, that's a fancy. That's not at all what I wanted to do. Thanks. Uh, that's a fancy looking place right there. Okay, so, um, yes. That's great. Engine overhaul gives us an extra action point. Production speed, don't want that. Frontier outpost, eh, it's okay. It's not, eh, you know, it's a thing. No, I want us to do guardians. Okay, yes, let's do guardians. I want to I wanna go with the guardians. Guardians of the Valentine. Okay, jump back into the car, please. Jump back into the car, please. Car. Uh, I guess take us over here? Yeah, just take us over here, I guess. Cool. And you guys, I guess both can come out of here. And you, ma'am, I would like for you to take a look at what's over here. Uh, some, sh a lot of cinder blocks. That's what's over there. Wow. Okay, cool. All right, let's see. Let's go back to base and I, oh, we still haven't built our radar up. Yeah, we need a bit more, um, yeah, we need a bit more of that stuff there. Oh yeah, we also need another windmill. Was there another thing that we were building besides the radar? Oh, because the radar takes 30... Yeah, that takes 30 power, so we need both of these to get built up. So we do need uh, quite a bit of metal. Ooh, look at these guys. They're bringing in a lot of food, a lot of clothing. Yeah, sure, take them in. Yeah, let's go. Uh, apparently they've turned violent, and they will be summarily executed. All right. Well, good job. All right, yeah, good job, good job. So they don't count as dead people. The, those people that come up, they're not they are not something that we have to worry about. Hmm. Ooh, they're a dangerous bunch. Ooh, look at all those cockroaches. We could eat so many cockroaches. Okay, so I guess they just hop back in. Can I... Okay, you do that. Awesome. Boone, I would like for you to come out. And come over to here. And go ahead and scavenge that. Yeah, cool. All right. So that's everybody. And, oh, look at the wheat. We got the wheat that's growing. Yeah, look at all, look at all that beautiful wheat. I really, I do like these, uh, these zoomed in, um, kind of viewpoints. I don't do them enough, but I do like the way they look. Oh, I love the little kiddie pool that they got out in the front. Oh, I never noticed that before. That's awesome. 
Yeah, so it seems like metal is, oh good, and they built this one first. I'm so happy they, they, they smartly built the power first. Hey, our trade is back. I don't remember what was traded. What did we get for that? Oh, we got a bunch of uh, stuff. Yeah, we got a bunch of firewood and stuff, didn't we? Yeah. Yep. We got a bunch of firewood. Hey, and we finished Guardians. Uh-oh, nuclear fallout's back. Harvest crops before they wither, stockpile iodine pills, build more medic tents, assign workers, blah, 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 blah. All right, well. Okay. Iodine we do not have much of, unfortunately. Uh, crops? We have plenty of food. I don't think we're going to run out of food this time. So, that's awesome. Um, especially because we also have these that are growing. It's unfortunate that it is going to kill our wheat. Um, I was hoping to get a bit more wheat in before that, but I guess not. Oh, well. Um... Yeah, what else do we need to do then to prepare? I guess the only other thing would be build another build another medical station, but I don't think that I have build another field hospital. Actually, I do have all the resources to do that. It doesn't require any any uh Yeah, it doesn't require any uh any of that other stuff to build a field hospital. Okay. Yeah, sure. Let's just throw one down then. We'll throw one down and I don't have the people for it, but I suppose it could, uh, I suppose it could be helpful. Oh, uh, I don't have... Colonist is infected. Hasn't even started yet. A fallout hasn't even happened, and you're already complaining? Jeez. I don't know why all these people are grimy, too. Poorly nourished, death, dirty, malnourished, infected. I'm never going to get these people happy, I'm starting to, to realize. They're never going to be happy. Alright, you can harvest that. Please harvest that. And... Yes, come down here? Can you come down this way? Oh no, you can't because you have to get through there first. Yeah, okay. Well, I guess come this way? Well, I guess harvest that stuff and then you can... Uh... You really uh, kind of went on a thing that was uh, more than what I expected. <clears throat> okay, so... Let's go and... Yeah, I keep talking about how I want to... Yeah, so since we're, since we're going to get weed up again, I want to get... Um, I want to make bread. I really want to make bread. I want to I want to get to the point where we're making bread. That, that just sounds fun to me. Okay, so radar, yes. Okay, you can finally build it up. Not that it's going to help this time around, you know. And they're also not building this anymore. Why is this not built? Oh, okay, it's going. There we go. And it's facing the wrong way. Of course it is. Oh, our specialists are ready to go again, apparently. Okay, get a little bit of that going. Uh, nope. Uh, you. Yep. Harvest that. Oh. Oh, that's got nothing left in it. Silly me. Excuse me. I guess just get back in the car and wait for Cub. All right. Let's keep going. Let's just wait for this nuclear fallout to hit and, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, we can build guard towers now, right? That's a thing? Right, guard post. Yeah, needs metal. Guard post protects your colony against all enemies. Guards patrol around the building and automatically react to threats inside their work area. Colonists working as guards can be equipped with weapons, which make them more effective. Okay. So that's cool. So this will affect. So effectively, they'll um, protect everything in this area, right here. So that's cool. Yeah, and then this gate also has four, uh, an uh, option for four people to work in it as um, guards. 
The only problem is we just don't have... We just don't have the people for it. We just don't have enough people. And I don't understand... I just don't understand where all our people are. What are they doing? I guess maybe we don't need... Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, I guess maybe we don't need that many people on the trapper post. Okay, so this is building, right? Okay, yep, yeah, that's that's working. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, I did not tell them to harvest that. That was my bad. Ugh. <clears throat> Alright, so... Yeah, yeah, damaged crops. Yeah, I know. I know. That's alright. We have plenty of crops. I'm not I'm not too worried about it. Um, and they're making plenty of delicious, delicious meals. So, oh man, the slavers are back again. Oh... I don't want, I don't want to. I don't want to, I'm sorry. Ugh, that's not great. Minor bandit event, jeez. Oh dude, that, that dude's glowing, look at him go. What are you doing? Oh, Lily. Happiness, she's very unhappy, she's desperate. Oh, it doesn't show that she's desperate. Maybe, maybe you can only have uh, one little picture at a time. Yeah, she's just kind of uh, just standing there. She's not seeking treatment. She's just um, she's just gonna let herself go. Apparently, okay. Well, it's not the life I would have chosen, but it's not me. So, uh, let's see. I guess we probably have people ready for stuff. Yeah, yeah, we got people ready for stuff. Okay. Collect up the rest of that, why don't you, please? Try not to blow yourself up too badly. Thank you. Okay, come back. They're going to be ready to go in three, two, one. And we're back. Hop in the car, please. And the car can now go... To... I don't know. Don't know where the car can go. I guess the car can go over here. Oops. Oops car can go over here okay so every time you move the car the car breaks down a little bit so that's good to know um yeah that's very good to know you don't want to stray too far away from the car okay so let's head back and try to wait this out i guess nine colonists irradiated yeah yeah i know i know guys i know I know. They're just trying to harvest four corn. It's so sad. So sad. Am I am I glowing? Uh, thirteen people irradiated. I think that's more than what I'm actually able to treat at a single time. I think it's because I'm out of iodine pills. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Unfortunately, that's probably gonna... Oh, that's that's why that keeps doing that. That's why that keeps doing that. Okay. Hey, uh... You know what? I would prefer you go get the research. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. People in the car. Car people. Um... Please pick up some of that. Car lady, come over here, please. And pick up some of that. Cool. All right. And colonist approaches you. The great unknown, a visibly nervous but pumped up woman approaches you. Look, so I've been thinking, it's great here, but there's gotta be something more out there, right? And I kinda wanna see it. So don't take this the wrong way, but I might be leaving soon. I need something more, something better. Uh, so we can tell her, hail her, how selfish she's being, warn her about the dangers of the world, or equip her for a journey and wish her good luck. I'm not about holding people against their will. We're kind of going through a nuclear fallout right now. I kind of get it if she wants to leave. 
Uh, seeing how determined the woman is, you equip her as best you can and wish her good luck. She looks absolutely ecstatic to leave the settlement and venture out into the world, but after some time, you see her return, though you hardly recognize her with multiple pelts wrapped around her body in a large backpack. Nah, it wasn't that great after all, she says, while she hands you the cargo from her back. Uh, we've got three parts and nine cloth. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. Okay. Hey, and the nuclear fallout is over. So, uh, we still need, okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Sorry, go away, please, thank you. Okay, so we got delicacies, that's cool. Uh, what can we go to next? I think actually we should go over to production and we should get junior engineers, which will let us put an extra, mm. Do we want to do that though? No, we need stuff that's going to allow us to, um, that's gonna allow us to take people out of working. We need people. So where are, oh, refinery. Yeah, okay. Well, Refrox on, on uh, bleh, ref, uh, I lost the ability to speak. <clears throat> Unlocks refinery for manufacturing fuel from sunflower seeds. Refineries are essential in providing a steady source of fuel for the colony's exploration needs. Without fuel, vehicles cannot be repaired. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yep. 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 That's, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Uh, ooh, that's probably a pretty good one to get, actually. Uh, let's see. Hmm. 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 What can we do that's going to get people? Hmm. What can we do that's going to get people out of production and get them doing more stuff? Hmm. They require parts to function. Now, where does the parts come in? Parts come in from somewhere, I would guess production. Oh, mechanic shop, I'm pretty sure produces the parts, doesn't it? We haven't built that. So I feel like we're kind of at, huh. Are we kind of at a point where we don't need Well, I mean, we have the trappers, so I guess we might as well, I guess we might as well just research that. So yeah, I mean, it'll it'll just give us more fiber, uh, which we're producing from somewheres, but I don't remember where, now that I try to think about it. I actually don't remember where we're producing it. Hmm, okay. So they're gonna try and build up that stuff, and I wanna see us build up now that we have it, a mill and a bakery. Okay, so that's gonna produce, at the cost of five flour and t only two wood, two firewood, that's gonna give us 10 bread? Wow. That sounds awesome. That sounds like a great trade. Um. Yeah, okay, so what is a, okay, so that's gonna take five, yeah, okay, see, this is why I always love like the bakery production chain in any game is you get it seems like you get exponential results from it yeah okay so we're gonna build a mill i think we have resources enough to do that yes we do and the bakery and the bakery doesn't require power either oh this is great this is so good i love it i love it so much so all these things are gonna this all these things are gonna be converted into uh making wheat Pretty much that's what's gonna happen here. Okay. So that's gonna go there. What do you mean I don't have the resources available for that? Five cement, 15, no, I, oh, there's no carriers available to do that. You know what? That's a very good point. Um, we don't need a death person right now. Oh, and we don't need, we don't need to be working this at all. Actually, we have tons of people. Yes, we do. Okay. So they're making corn. 
Can I grow wheat in a greenhouse? Does that work? Yeah, it does. Huh, okay. I could grow gr grain in a wheat ha Wait, what? Grain in a wheat? Wait, what? Never mind. Ignore that. I've been recording for several hours now, and my brain has started to stop. It's started to stop. Yes, it has. It's getting, it's getting bad, guys. It's getting bad. I'm starting to lose it. Okay. Uh, we definitely need a person here. Okay, so skinning is completed. We are going to go for the junior engineers and get an extra person on each of those, um, each of these things to just increase the production more. Uh, great. So you have expended everything that's over there. I guess let's go over here. You've probably... No, you have not expended everything. You have not cut it all down. Surprisingly. Um, and where... That's a trapper. That's a trapper. You're both trappers. Okay. Yep. Both getting good amounts of food. And I think, actually... Let's demolish this. I think that we're okay to demolish that. What do these guys want? Let's see. Can you let us in? I'd rather not talk about what happened to us. We're all here now, aren't we? Everyone's alive. Everyone's safe. We made it right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's accept them. Let's go. Yeah, I'm good with that. And, oh, yeah, look. We have a guardhouse. Yeah, guardhouse. Okay. So, I guess let's put a second guard person on yeah and let's get enough people guarding yeah let's do that okay so we need we need a we need more homes so we're back to where we need to build houses we're back to where we don't have supplies to do so hmm well we can get uh some supplies back from this I think the best course of action right now is we're actually just going to pop everyone back into here. And let's just try to get back to Valentine. They do have a lot of concrete, which is good. Where's Valentine? Valentine. Okay. It's going to take us a bit to get there. Hopefully we can actually get there before the car breaks down. Now that I'm looking at it, that's going to take a while. Uh, let's see. Is there anything good there? Components. Pretty decent. Not bad. Okay. Junior engineers are complete. Okay. So, I would like for you... Can I click on you? Yep. You. And we actually have plenty of plastic. I don't want to do more plastic, but we could use more stuff there. Okay. That's... That's looking pretty good. And you know what? I think I'm going to leave it there, but I hope that you will all join me for the next video. As always, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time.